Welcome to WebStyle Press. How to add CDN link in HTML? I get this question a lot. This HTML page has bootstrap classes such as container and accordion and font awesome icon classes. Output looks like this. So what is CDN? What does CDN mean? CDN stands for Content Delivery Network. It's a system of distributed servers that deliver pages and other web content to a user based on the geographic location of the user, the origin of the web page, and a content delivery server. The goal of a CDN is to serve content to end users with high availability and high performance. CDNs are often used for large scale websites and are particularly useful for delivering static content and media streams. The basic idea is that by spreading the content across many different servers located in different places, the content can be delivered more efficiently to users. This can help to speed up the load time of websites, improve user experience and reduce bandwidth costs. For example, if you have a website that is hosted in the United States, Without a CDN, a user in Australia would need to load the content from across the globe. However, if you use a CDN and the CDN has a server in Australia, then the content can be served from that local server which can be much faster. In web development, CDN links are often used to serve libraries like jQuery, Bootstrap, Font Awesome and more. By using a CDN, you not only get the benefit of the content being delivered quickly, but also the possibility of the file being cached if the user has visited a site that uses the same CDN, making the loading time even faster. So how to add CDN in HTML? To add a CDN link in your HTML, you generally use a script tag for JavaScript files or a link tag for CSS files. Here's an example of how to do both. You can add a CDN link to a JavaScript library or file like this. In this case, the file link in src attribute is the CDN link to the JavaScript library or file. You can add a CDN link to a CSS library or file like this. In this case, the file link in href attribute is the CDN link to the CSS library or file. You typically put these tags in the head section of your HTML document, but they can also go in the body section, depending on the specific situation and requirement. Now, from where can we get the CDN links? Go to CDN.js website and search for required library. So, how to add Bootstrap CDN in HTML? Search for Bootstrap, select Twitter Bootstrap, copy script tag bootstrap.min.js and paste in HTML before closing body tag. Copy CSS link tag bootstrap.min.css and paste in the HTML. And you are done. Save. And the output is here. Now the page is reflecting bootstrap styles. Okay, how to add font or some CDN link in HTML? Similarly, at cdnjs.com, search for Font Awesome. Select Font Awesome. Copy CSS link tag all.min.css. Paste in the HTML. In head section, I have copied CSS link tags in head section. Save. And see this icon appeared. We had its HTML in place already. Similarly, how to add jQuery CDN in HTML? Search for jQuery, select jQuery, copy script tag jQuery.min.js,
paste in the HTML. And that's it. So what did we do here? Instead of downloading CSS and script files from official websites of Bootstrap and Fontosm, we used their CDN links from CDN.js website. These are open source free libraries, so CDN.js hosts these resources for free, so that developers can get the benefit of using these files from cloud and via content delivery network. You don't have to download these files and link them manually every time for each new project. Just use CDN links. You want jQuery, Fontosm, or Bootstrap? Go to cdnjs.com, search library, get the script or CSS link tags, and use in your projects. It makes you more productive and efficient in building new projects. Now, what does CDN mean in a URL? When you see CDN in a URL, it typically stands for Content Delivery Network. In the context of a URL, it often means that the file you are accessing is being delivered from a CDN, not the original server where the website is hosted. For instance, if you see a URL like this, this means that the JavaScript file jQuery.min.js is being delivered from the Cloudflare CDN. Using a CDN can help speed up the delivery of files, especially for the users who are geographically distant from the original server. For example, if the original server is in the United States, but a user is in Australia, delivering files from a server in Australia can be much faster than delivering them from the United States. So when you see CDN in a URL, it is a good indication that the website is optimized for the fast delivery of static files like images, style sheets, and scripts, regardless of where users are located in the world. Okay, I hope it helped. Like, share, subscribe, and I will see you in the next video.